guys, I'm SparklingRose17, and I'm Animated by Team 1. So, this video is a continuation of our previous video, Crossplay 101, but this is part 2. So, it's, yeah, 1, oh, one, one. one. <laughs> Doesn't part work out very well. 2. Again, you can't see my fingers there. Anyway. Again, because we did this before. This is our second This is our second time trying to do this. Anyway, not the point. So, in our previous video, if you've watched it, this you clearly know what it was in, but if you haven't and you're just tuning in now, you should watch it because we touch up on some important things like expenses, like how to get there and stuff like that. We touch up on your look, and we just finished with vendor rooms and all that kind of cool stuff, like you know sales that just happen to be there. So anyway, um, anything else on vendor rooms or the art galleries or anything? Mm, not really. So. Use your money wisely. <laughs> Don't blow it all in one day, because then if you see something you really like that happens to be this the second day, you're out of luck. Like if you see a K on like plush or a Vocaloid thing, like the second day you blew all your money the first day, you're gonna be very disappointed because if you like if your favorite character is like and red, you can't exactly return any of this stuff. No. I'm gonna assume they won't let you. No, I can assume that they're not gonna give you your money back. Like everyone wants a souvenir, but you know. I, don't got, want the I got basically two pictures for like two bucks at the very last day, and they're like gorgeous <laughs> pictures that I'll have for the rest of my life. So, yeah, those were chief souvenirs. And I should have got a picture. You should have. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we kind of touched up on this earlier. So, moving on. On um, how to act at a convention in cosplay. Now, um, 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 I forget what to say. Okay. Um, you should act a character as much as humanly possible. I mean, don't just like. If you're not downstairs or wherever this convention's actually happening. Like, if you're at the mall, don't act like... I'm don't gonna be like, okay, friends, you must call me Songo every time I did we're call, up here. I did call our friend, some people, like, Songo. Like, I was like, hey, Songo. Yeah, cool. that, you know, that, that is sort of fun. kind of like weird if you room. make your friends call you by your costume. Everybody might whole just friend, think like, you're, like, days. delusional or something. Because it'd be like, oh. Yeah, Jackie, it's Songo! Okay! Yes, no, <laughs> d don't be that creepy person. <laughs> we are pretty weird creepy, but we're not that creepy. Yes, but <laughs> fellow anime lovers, you know how we can be. That's how we roll. We're very weird. Well, at least we are. Chris the Devil from Hell is in here, though, sadly. Yes, we have to credit her in the end, by the way. Yeah, we do. <laughs> I've been forgetting anyway, to do this. We didn't mention her in the first video, Sorry. not that we remember. But any, we're gonna stop rambling on about random stuff you probably don't really care about. Yeah. Anyway, what we were saying, um, how to act. Mm -hmm. If you're getting a picture taken, don't just stand there, like, with your arms down, being like, a stranger's taking my picture. I'm just gonna stand here and, you know, let them take my picture. Do a pose or something. Make yourself look cool. Something that your character would do. Like, if you're, like, from Final Fantasy, like, Cloud or something, look like you're about to fight, like, Saffron. <laughs> I, I play video games. Pictures. She doesn't really play video games. So. I fail at <laughs> video games. Like, virtually every video game except for the Mario. <laughs> I fail every at Star. Mario. Anyway, um, if your character or whoever you're being has a catchphrase or something they do, definitely say and or do it as much as you can, but I don't mean like run around wherever you're staying yelling KUME KUME RA! You almost look very weird because for KUME KUME RA you do this. Yeah. But if you Jackie go around just going reference. like this, saying that, you look very weird and everybody be like, WTF face. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And again, we touched upon pictures earlier, but don't run away from the poor people trying to take your picture. They'll be like, WAIT! Come back! Because you don't no. really want somebody chasing you around <laughs> to get your picture. I if somebody's following you, it's not because they're stalking. Well, it might be, but it's, it's probably because they want a hug or a picture or to at least know who your character is. They're not stalking you. No one cared who I was. That's flippy just who you I think I already told you. Well, no one really wants to watch Happy Tree Friends. Like, <laughs> we don't even watch Happy Tree Friends. I just liked I just liked the character Flippy. I thought he was cool. He's not cool. He is cool. Anyway, anything you want to say on that note? Oh, um, well, not really. All right, moving on. Okay, these are more of the don'ts to do at 
well, more to don't do. Yeah. At a we sort of covered. Do not let your make your friends like say, I'm gonna like do not go. I you I'm sorry. <laughs> you have to call me. Um, I'll say um Tomaki from Oran Host Club. You have to call me back for the whole weekend. We are here. That would give me. <laughs> yes. Another thing is. You know, weapons are cool for your costume, but don't bring in a sword. Like, don't bring in a katana or anything to it. You'll be kicked out, kicked out, and I'll be terrified of you. Arrested, and don't go like around waving your sword like, "Hey, everyone, I'm gonna kill you all." If it looks real, like, don't do that. It's scary, and you will get kicked out. I was warned about that. I made myself a Bowie knife and a hard burn. Oh, <laughs> speaking of the don'ts. We touched up on costumes earlier in our previous video. Mm -hmm. So, um, don't wear the most revealing costume. If you're person. being black rock shooter, um, it makes sense, but, um, but you don't go to, like, the mall in, like, a bikini top and just shorts. There are you some people who have actually gotten kicked out because of the stuff they have worn cosplaying. I saw a like, guy at Speedo there. That's oh, scary. <laughs> anyway, like... During our session that we attended called Cosplay 101, and that's why everybody was saying that, anyway, um, she said that she spent, like, hours looking for a picture of this one particular that guy. That wasn't hentai. No hentai. Hentai's scary. <laughs> yes, don't come as a hentai. Please. Yes, hentai. Do us all a favor. Yes. Anyway, so this, she spent hours looking for a picture that was, like, G-rated so she could show it. There was a man in a skirt. At Sailor mm -hmm. Moon, and he was super fat, and he, and he shaved his legs. Isn't that fat? He, was so, it, he had a beard. So it doesn't make him fat if he has a beard. <laughs> well, I mean, <laughs> I don't know, I'm not talking about, well, he was sort of fat, but he also had a beard. He was like a 40 year old man, dressed as Sailor Moon. Mm -hmm. Pedo. <laughs> Another so, thing is, if you're there, and, okay. I'm not, I'm not against guys dressing as girls, just. Uh, just try to make yourself look a little like appropriate. Hair. Yes, appropriate. Like if you're gonna do that, just make sure you're not wearing the tightest skirt ever that shows everything. That no offense, like I'm sure somebody out there like wants to see because they love you and everything. But save that. No one at the convention wants to see your junk through your underpants. Sorry, but no, we honestly don't. We're there to have fun, and you know there are some people who bring their kids there. Yeah, like and you know they, you don't want to scar them for life. Like my brother. You're not scar my brother. <laughs> <laughs> um, what's another thing? If you have big weapons, um, like her boomerang, she has. be unlike me and try not to whack everyone in the head. I like you whack two strangers in the face and you hit me in the eye. I kind of felt bad and I still do. So just be con conscious, like aware of those. Warning: Girls' love is not an anime or a manga. We, we found that out the hard rally. way. So if you see something Yuri titled is girls, girls love, love yeah, we've or boys it. love, it's gay and lesbian yeah. anime. If so you guys if didn't know that. So like, if you're into that stuff, cool, go. But like, yeah, warning for those who don't, aren't like, into yeah, it, yeah. like us, we book out of this so fast. I'm not like, there was a truck of smoke behind us. Probably. <laughs> Everyone gave us weird looks when we like closed the door. Mm. <laughs> I can only imagine what the person said afterwards. Oh, God. Anyway, um, if it's if the convention is around where you live or just maybe it another really state, doesn't really anymore. I don't know. <laughs> so if it's in another state or something, you may see people you know. Don't bother them if they're with their friends. Like, don't just constantly follow them around if they don't want you to be there. Oh, and if you see like a YouTube person, like I did, I saw a few. I tried to take a different pictures, but I wasn't being creepy, like, oh, I saw you on YouTube. Well, that might be okay. You if you're, like, super hyper, but I wasn't hyper. I'm, I'm actually super... really shy. One more don't. Avoid being super hyper, because, like, you know, in the sessions and all that, you honestly, no one wants to hear you freaking out in the corner. <laughs> like, you're supposed to listen and answer questions, and, you know, it's fun. But it's not fun if you're sitting next to the person who won't shut up. You're allowed to go fangirl and fanboy at the vendor room. Because I saw a girl, like, pink chibi thing. I was like, oh my god, it's girl, I love girl. So I bought it. <laughs> it's hanging on my... Yes, but avoid bouncing board. around the room like an angry monkey. <laughs> yes, I'm cheesies. Here. Anyway. Yes, I'm hyper at cheesies in pie. 
Alright. <laughs> I love to meet the pie. Anyway, um so what's another don't? Hmm. Don't us do not, do not, do not, do not, do not. Do not go to the mall, like if you want to cosplay outside a convention. Do not go to the mall with your weapons. <laughs> Cause you know, if they look real enough, it you but, will be asked to leave and you know, you might get banned for carrying weapons and the cops might be called. And honestly, you don't want to miss your convention because you're in jail or you're being, like, um, yelled at by a cop in the middle of the mall. That would be sort of scary. And if you do go to the mall in your cosplay, you will be asked questions. You will get weird looks. Yeah. Old lady asked us if we actually dressed like this. Yes, but anyway, it was actually pretty funny. Yes. I think I scared, like, a five-year-old with my green hair and army outfit. Maybe a little bit. (laughs) <laughs> um, hmm, what else? No, 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 no. I think that's about everything. Yeah, there's probably something. Weapons. When you're making weapons, about weapons, there's one more thing on that. When you're making a weapon, because, like, don't go out and buy a sword, as we said earlier. If you buy it, like, clearly it's not going to look exactly real. Like, you're not, you might not mistake it for, like, a freaking knife, but if you have a knife or something, you can't even bring it if it's in its sheath or anything like that. You will be asked to put that away or you will be taken out and removed. But if you're making it, um, there's some ways to avoid people thinking they're real. Like, you know, make it a different color, like the little gray knife part. Maybe paint that black instead. Or wrap it in tape, like the thing, as in to look like it's fake. Even a better if you have, like, Death of the Kid weapons, like from um, Soul Eater. Try to buy like those cheap guns from like Walmart that have like a little orange tip at the end. Then you'll know it's fake. <laughs> yeah. But buy two if you're dedicated. So like weapons, I know earlier we said cosplay should look almost exact. Weapons, they don't have to be completely exact because you know that you will be asked questions. Yes. Where convention we went to, we had to go through like the process of having all That's our weapons checked. Every convention too, because they're not just gonna let you walk around basically having. Well, real you don't know that. We've only been to one. Yeah, but I'm gonna assume that they check at every convention. Or they trust people. Oh, and if you're making a big weapon, you styrofoam, not wood. Because if you do accidentally hit someone upside the head, you don't want to have some guy knocked out on the floor because you hit them with a big wooden weapon. You'll be like, oh my god! And I'm not even sure if they let you through with a ginormous boomerang. They thought they yours was like wooden or something. Yeah, check. but then they checked and it wasn't. <laughs> I forget what I was going to say. It was like something important. I forget now. Jeopardy. <laughs> Love that show. I know. <laughs> anyway, do you remember it? No. Mm. No, I don't. Know. Oh, one more thing. If you're staying at a hotel with a pool that closes at a certain time. Anime conventions run really late into the night. If, like, you might have to leave to go do whatever you want in the hotel. Eat dinner. <laughs> yeah, don't starve yourself the whole time. Like, You'll look very weird, and everybody be like, are you okay? <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, so if it is at a hotel, just remember there are actual people staying there, not at the convention. And they might think you're very weird, but... Yeah. Yes, ignore them. <laughs> As we well, did they, ask. They're going to figure out it's convention. Oh, and elevators will be slower uh, around convention times. No one should be like, stairs oh, is crap, very it's useful. Really... Yeah. Because <laughs> stairs are awesome with during They are time. awesome. So, yeah. Is, do you think the elevator is the quickest route? No. Stairs Last thing I'm going to say is, if you go with friends, make sure that you guys all equally split the cost. You're all paying for your own meals and stuff. Don't stick it on one poor friend. Poor friend, poor. Not poor like that, but don't bill one friend. Honestly, even if they offer, do not do that. Yeah, because conventions and cosplays are expensive enough. You You don't need a (laughs) lot. So, So, yeah, I suggest if you want, go with friends. You can all be this, like, a big group of anime people. Like, we're planning. We might. Yeah. If we ever go to another convention. Yeah. (laughs) So, that's about it. Yeah. So thanks for listening, and if you have any questions, you can most certainly inbox us or write it down in the little box down there. Comment! <laughs> Comment, subscribe, rate, whatever you want to do. Please, no hate Subscribe! Or
You have to subscribe to us. This is us signing off. Goodbye. You go that way, I'll go this way. Woohoo!